We built a coffee shop, of course, which was a lot of electrical updates, plumbing updates. Had to remove a brick wall that wasn't working for us and put up a structural beam. We did a facade improvement, rehab, and we built a deck on the riverfront side of the building. Started roasting coffee in 2014, Groundware Coffee Roasters, and then started the coffee shop, building out the coffee shop. I thought, oh, how hard could it be? Call an electrician, call the plumber, you know, draw up the coffee bar design. I know it's cliche, but it's gonna be 20% more than you think, at least. It's gonna take 20% longer, so just plan for that. Get to know the people at the city. They're there to help you. I first reached out to the EDA and they were super helpful, guided me along, put me in touch with a lot of contacts I needed to get in contact with. There was the micro grant through the city. That was the first one we got a hold of when we were doing the coffee shop build out. And that was awesome because funds were drying up at that time and it just gave us that little extra push to get through and open up. Another grant we took advantage of was the Riverfront grant, which allowed us to partially fund a deck build, which expanded our outdoor seating by probably 50%, which has been super awesome. We also took advantage of the facade grant. Without that tuck pointing and re rebuilding that peak that was crumbling at the top of our building, Probably would have got pushed off a couple more years, unfortunately, because that stuff is not cheap. And I really enjoy the density of downtown. There's like shops, people live here, people work here. There's a lot of energy and activity. That's kind of my vibe. So I really thought it'd be a good fit for a coffee shop. It's been really rewarding just seeing all the conversations and the connections that happen in the coffee shop on a daily basis. 